I've seen a bunch of TikToks of people trying to sell fast flag, which kind of makes no sense. They're trying to sell it for like 100 to 800 Robux. I just think it's stupid because why should someone pay for a performance boost? It's Roblox. It's a really low end game. People shouldn't really need to pay for a performance boost. I've already already made a video on previously on how to make your Roblox actually potato. And that video in itself is pretty good and helpful for people. They should be using that instead. Let's actually take a look at these little Discord servers that are trying to sell fast flags and see what they're saying. All right, this is a TikTok page that I saw, right? You would see a video like this on TikTok. Oh, his ping's bad. After using fast flags, oh, his ping's all good, right? And then Discord DM for buy. Like, you're telling me people are really spending Robux just to buy? Bro, you gotta really be crazy to do this shit. Let's take a look at the server anyways. Oh, oh ping, fast flash, bomb, boost, FPS plus low ping, low DD mouse, and keyboard, and low latency. What I'm about to do is I'm about to copy all this, go into the deep sea AI and ask them if they can find me some fast flex for all of these. We got all these options. We got one to six. The only thing we don't have is bomb me because nobody knows what the fuck bomb me is. So what I'm about to do is I'm about to get each of these fast flex off in the block strap, put them in, and we're about to go test them. Before we even use this, let's get into a game and we'll check our ping first. All right, we're trying out the ping fast flag and we're looking at my ping without the fast flags. We're at like a hundred ping. I'm not gonna lie, it's not the best thing, but we'll, we'll we'll see what it is when we get in game. Oh, okay, light hundred tens, light hundreds. Let's switch. All right, so I've copied the fast flags. Boom, go to block track. Went to add new. Put import JSON. Click OK. Boom, got all these fast flags in. I feel flag optimized network. That's really intriguing. So we know before that my ping was in the hundred ten to hundred range, and we're about to go back into blade ball and see what it is now. Let's take a look at that. Wait, hold on. Wait a second. It went from one hundred to eight. Okay, wait. That's not bad though. We have we we just got a decrease in ping. This actually might be good. We gotta test this out in the game. Are right, we about to see if the ping stays the same? And yes, it, it is staying the same. Hold on, wait. This might have been a cook. Eighty you know, consistent pings. You know, fast reaction time. Okay, just take me, take me, kill me, kill me, kill me. I'm done. I'm done. So that's great. We 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 know that works. You know, we are from 110 to 90. Let's check the next option now. Now we got fast dash, which is a fast flag that people are using in this one battlegrounds game to dash fast. And you know, people get caught using it, it's cheating. So don't do what I'm doing. This is a ethical purpose only. I'm just showing y'all uh, that it works. I'm still putting this in the description. I'm not going to lie. All right, let's see. Let's try this out. So to dash on prefix Q, right? Yeah, and no, okay, so that's how you dash. So we dash without the fast flag, and we're about to apply that fast flag, and then about to try out dashing again. Copy these fast flags that are given. Add new, import JSON. Okay. okay let's see if there's any difference. Now, I kind of see a difference. Hold on. Maybe I'm bullshitting. This might be a placebo effect. I don't know. I'm not too sure, but y'all gotta let me know. Boost FPS plus low ping. Combine the FPS with, with network optimizations. When you apply them, it's only gonna show the, the new thing that you added, but I guess we may change this to these other ones. I don't think this is gonna work. I'm not gonna lie. Let's try a gun game for this. Hold on. The ping is insanely low. We're, we're at... Oh. Yes, 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 yes. And this game looks like complete shit as well. Hold on. Is this a method? Yo, this might be a method. Hold on. Oh, shoot. Where's my FPS at? I can't even see. I reckon my FPS is high though, right? That looks like it works. Oh, next one. All right, we're doing the low delay mouse and keyboard, but before we even do that, you know, we're gonna... For this game, uh, you know, you can check your... I don't know, I'm just bullshitting, but you can, you can check uh, the latency, right? Uh, I'm, I'm also gonna be doing that for the last one, but, uh, you know, everything looks fine to me, you know, the movements. We're gonna, we're gonna test that. I don't even know if you can get a noticeable difference. Add new, import, save. Keyboard and mouse delay removal. Oh! What? Nope, he's hacking. I do feel a more very, I, I do feel a very fluid movement though. Very fluid. This might be placebo effect. I'm, I'm not bullshitting. This, this might be placebo effect. I mean, that's that, but uh, we're going to be checking the last one. Okay, we're now in the game. Visualize server, visualize client. Yo. Wait. Okay, never mind. Wait. No, okay, okay. Before, before I didn't work, but I can clearly see. You know, there's definitely a difference. That, that is definitely closer. I guess all of these fast flags are kind of like debunked. And um, I'm gonna put all of these in the description. Yeah, you know, I'm not trying to let bro go out of business. But I'm saying fast flags do not have any value to them. That's my opinion. This is accessible. It should be accessible to everyone else. Like, it's not like people should pay for performance. But uh, yeah, that's all I really wanted to talk about. If y'all want more, then you know, y'all know what to do.